This is the Airbus ACJ 319 Neo, a masterpiece in the realm of luxury private jets that blends an ultra luxurious cabin with a range of 6,750 nautical miles or 12,500 kilometers and a maximum cruise speed of Mach 0.82. The ACJ 319 Neo story began with the launch of the A320 Neo family in December 2010. Airbus aimed to provide a more fuel-efficient and environmentally friendly option to its existing A320 family. In fact, the NEO variants featured new engines and aerodynamic improvements, leading to significant fuel savings and reduced emissions. Recognizing the potential for a corporate jet version, Airbus announced the ACJ 319 NEO in May 2015. The aircraft was designed to offer the same efficiency improvements coupled with luxurious interiors and customization options tailored to the private jet market. Stay with us till the end of the video because here is everything you need to know about the Airbus ACJ 319 AO. Fitting out an ACJ is all about personal taste. However, Airbus has floated perhaps the most lavish interior imaginable thanks to a partnership with Italian supercar maker Atelier Pagani to create a lavish interior called Infinito. The design is a blend of art and science, featuring state-of-the-art composite materials like carbo-titanium, combined with the typical design language of Pagani. The cabin measures 7 feet 4 inches or 2.23 meters in height and 12 feet 1 inch or 3.7 meters in width. The most groundbreaking design element of this concept has to be the sky ceiling, which delivers real-time views of the skies above the aircraft, just as if it didn't have a roof on at all. Touches of soft leather are offset by real wood and carbon fiber, reminiscent of what you'd expect to find in a Pagani Huayra supercar. The cabin is divided into various living areas, including a lounge, a dining area, and even a cinema. Each cabin area is separated by transparent dividers, which turn opaque at the touch of a button, providing privacy when needed. Leathers, woods, and carbon fiber live together in stylish harmony, just like they do inside a Pagani Huayra. The ACJ 319 Neo has plenty of onboard space for its occupants with four large living areas. Each of those areas has lie flat beds for additional sleeping space, but that's just for the guests. For the primary user, naturally, there's a generous bedroom with a king-sized bed, complete with an ensuite shower and bathroom. For entertainment, the master suite boasts a 55-inch TV screen. There are two further fixed bedrooms and another two bathrooms on board. Along with the lie flat beds, this provides accommodation for as many as 18 people to sleep on board. Throughout the aircraft, passengers can enjoy a state-of-the-art in-flight entertainment system with full HD screens. The screens can also be set to display Airshow, the moving map from Collins Aerospace, or to stream exterior views from any of the five outside cameras. Passengers can also stay connected thanks to the 2Q high-speed internet with up to 70 megabits per second download speeds. An improved environmental control system lowers the cabin altitude to 6,400 feet at cruise flight. Better efficiency means the aircraft can carry less fuel and that leaves a lot more room for baggage. There's a 222 cubic feet or 6,300 liter luggage compartment big enough for 25 large suitcases, perfect for those who don't want to travel light. The cockpit is spacious, with adjustable seats and controls within easy reach, and the windows provide excellent visibility, measuring 120 inches or 300 centimeters across. The airplane features a six-screen electronic flight instrument system, displaying critical flight information such as airspeed, altitude, and navigation. The screens are typically 6 inches or 15 centimeters in size, providing clear and concise data. The aircraft employs a fly-by-wire control system, allowing for computerized control inputs that enhance stability and reduce pilot workload, which provides various flight envelope protections, ensuring safe operation within defined parameters. The ACJ 319 Neo shares a common cockpit design with other members of the A320 family, which allows pilots to transition between different aircraft models with minimal additional training, saving time, and resources. The ACJ 319 Neo is equipped with state of the art navigation systems, including GPS, INS, and VHF omnidirectional range with distance measuring equipment. These systems provide accurate navigation and allow for advanced procedures such as required navigation performance approaches. 
The flight management system is a complex computer system that automates many flight tasks. It assists in navigation, fuel efficiency, and flight planning, allowing pilots to input and manage the flight plan with ease. The aircraft is equipped with advanced weather radar, capable of detecting storms and turbulence up to 250 nautical miles or 463 kilometers away, which aids in strategic flight planning and ensures passenger comfort. The ACJ 319 NEO features modern communication systems, including VHF and HF radios, SATCOM, and ACARS. These systems enable continuous communication with air traffic control and airline operations. The TCAS provides alerts and guidance to avoid mid-air collisions. It communicates with other aircraft's transponders, providing real-time information on nearby traffic. The EGPWS provides warnings if the aircraft is in danger of colliding with terrain. It utilizes a database of the world's terrain and obstacles, providing both visual and auditory alerts to the flight crew. Now, let's talk about the engine, performance specifications, and how it flies. The key innovation of the aircraft is in its name, with NEO being an acronym for new engine option. In fact, the ACJ 319 NEO is powered by two of the industry's latest generation engines. You can choose between CFM International's Leap 1A and Pratt & Whitney's PW1100G, both of which have a TBO of 20,000 hours and produce 27,000 pounds of thrust. These engines offer further enhancements in range and efficiency. In fact, there is a 15% improvement in fuel efficiency and also a 15% reduction in CO2 emissions. The ACJ requires a takeoff distance of approximately 6,500 feet or 2,000 meters at sea level on a standard day, allowing it to operate from a wide range of airports, including those with shorter runways. The engines allow a maximum rate of climb per minute of 3,500 feet or 1,070 meters and a maximum cruising altitude of 41,000 feet or 12,500 meters, allowing it to fly above most commercial traffic and weather, thereby ensuring a smooth and efficient flight. The plane has a maximum cruise speed of Mach 0 0.82 or 550 knots, with an average hourly fuel burn of 6,000 pounds or 2,700 kilograms of Jet A. The aircraft's maximum range is an impressive 6,750 nautical miles or 12,500 kilometers, considering eight passengers on board, which enables non-stop travel between distant city pairs, such as Los Angeles to Beijing. The ACJ 319 NEO's full fuel payload is around 13,000 pounds or 5,900 kilograms, allowing for a generous amount of luggage and cargo, even with full fuel tanks. And finally, the aircraft's landing distance is approximately 4,700 feet or 1,430 meters, providing decent flexibility in choosing airports and ensuring safe landings even on shorter runways. The base purchase price for a new Airbus ACJ 319neo is $100 million before options, and the charter price is estimated at $12,000 to $18,000 per hour. Naturally, prices will vary depending on availability, fuel prices, ground fees, and more. While the annual fixed cost is roughly $1 million to $1.5 million, the average hourly operating cost is estimated at $6,000 to $9,000. Thank you for staying with us till the end. Here are two videos you can watch next. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.